Hey, are you a completely credulous fuck? Well, uh, guess what? There's a whole bunch of beliefs out there for you because you're just so gullible. Y you might be an intelligent person. I've known people who have wacky beliefs and they're uh, retired doctors, uh, nurses, etc. And, you know, they're intelligent people. They're intelligent people. But they also happen to believe a whole bunch of stupid stuff because of their biases, because of their wishful thinking. And yeah, they might well be educated, but they also happen to be people who are willing to take on board a whole bunch of nonsense. And that should tell you everything you need to know about people, really. Hey, they're an intelligent person, but... Oh, the but. Yeah, the but matters. The but is the big problem. But the thing is, a lot of people make out because they're educated, their belief is more valid. Oh, because you've got a doctorate or a degree or just an NVQ, that validates your belief? Um, no. No. There are many educated people, many doctors actually, many doctors who are Hindu, Sikh, uh, Christian, Muslim, it doesn't validate any of those religions just because you happen to have a bunch of doctors who happen to be Muslim. Hey, my dentist is a Muslim. But what does that tell you about Islam? Nothing actually. So yeah, you know, it's one of those things. A lot of people are just simply really quite credulous, willing to believe all sorts of wacky things. You know, whether it's psychics, mediums, televangelists, whatever the case may be. But just because you might have a background which suggests you've got some level of intelligence does not mean that you validate your belief by having some kind of underlying intelligence to you. You also have a whole bunch of biases that are leaning you in this direction and that direction. And that's the thing that really matters. And even if you are a quite rational, sceptical person in every other area of your life, well, guess what? Because you've got those biases in place regarding one particular subject in particular, say your religion or spirituality, it basically means you put aside your intellect in favour of what you would prefer to believe. 